Hey YouTube, it's Adam from I'm a Music Mogul. Today's tutorial, I'm going to show you how to install plugins when the plugin itself doesn't have a package installer. If you're getting questions on this, so let's get straight to it. Here is the plugin that we will be installing, Valhalla Room. And of course, as you can see, there is no package installer. There's just individual file formats and VST or component. So let's go ahead and show you how to get that plugin working in your favorite DAW. So the first thing I do is make sure that your DAW is closed before you add any of these uh, plugins to the appropriate folder. Then the second step you're going to do is go to your finder bar on top, hit go, hold down the option key and go to library. Next, you want to double click in audio plugins. So here you're going to choose which plugin you want to use. Now for components, that's only for logic. DigiDesign is for Pro Tools, and of course VST is for any other DAW. In this case, I'll be using Logic, so I'm going to be dragging in a component plugin. Double click that. Let's go ahead and open up our plugin folder once more. And I'm going to go ahead and copy over the component version of the plugin, and I'm going to make sure that it's in the 64-bit version as well, because, well, as we all know, Logic X likes 64-bit plugins only. So just by doing that, dragging the file from my plugin folder to the components folder, I have installed that plugin. Next step, let's go ahead and open up Logic. All right, so now we are in Logic. We've opened it up. Now let's go ahead and test to make sure that our plugin is uh, loadable in this DAW. So since this is a audio effect plugin, I'm gonna go to the audio effect uh, section right here. Go to audio units and uh, it's going off my screen right here, but trust me, it's there. Valhalla, Valhalla Room. And uh, it's going to ask me to validate the plugin, but for now, I'm just going to skip that. You can validate your plugins and follow the steps that uh, you may have for that plugin. So I'm just going to cancel. So now that we got the plugin installed, we're probably going to want to use the presets in the plugin as well. And by default, you have to load them in manually. So I'm going to show you how to do that right now. Let's go ahead to the top in our finder bar, hit go, hold down the option key and click library. Go over to audio, go over to presets. Valhalla DSP, which is the manufacturer uh, who made the plugin. And here is the plugin right here. And we're going to place all of the presets in this folder. Let's open up our original plugin folder. Library, audio, presets, Valhalla DSP, Valhalla Room, which is pretty much the same uh, tree of where we found our other preset folder on our computer. Rather than creating that manually, Logic did it for us. So I'm going to copy these and put them in here. Now let's go ahead and head over back to Logic. So now that we're back in Logic, you can see that the presets have not loaded in. What we will have to do is restart the plugins. Let's go ahead and close that and open it back up. And here you can find all of the presets that we've just loaded in. So that is how you install plugins that don't have a package installer themselves. If you do have any more questions on this, you can ask me in the comment section below. For more good videos like this, remember to hit that subscribe button. If you did like this and learned something, guys, please share the video as well. Talk to y'all soon. Later. Peace.